Hello guys, Void here and yes you guessed it right, today is the day where we are gonna take on the T-Rex and try and steal his egg, if we can manage to actually get the egg. There are a couple of things that you have to know about the T-Rex event. Once you get onto the map, the bushes that are there can hide you from the T-Rex. When it says that he smells you, be very careful because he is nearby and a couple of more steps could mean death. There are between 2 to 3 chests. They're actually quite important, they can drop quite a lot of parts and they can also drop weapons. There are usually two T-Rexes on the map, so it makes walking around really a lot harder. The first thing I would suggest doing is going around and looting all the chests that you can find before going for the egg. By just going around the map and looting the chests, you will also find the possible location of the egg and it would be a lot easier for you to just go ahead and loot it. If one of the T-Rexes is attacking you, the other one won't aggro you so you can just walk by him if you wanna run out of the map. Because running out of the map resets uh, the T-Rex and also by closing the game when he's next to you, you can also avoid that because once you get back in you will get to enter the zone again and basically reset it again. Now there are three things that you can get from the egg. You can get scales, you can get egg pieces, or you can get an actual egg. All of these items are useful to trade to the dealer. You cannot use the egg for the incubator. The other thing that I wanted to talk to you guys about is how to actually farm experience fast. Well, this is my personal way and in my opinion it is one of the best ways to do it. What I usually do is go into a green zone, whether it be rocks or the forest, depending on what I need more, logs or stone. After I choose the zone, I just go in there and I make sure the first thing to do is kill every single dinosaur so I can just put it on auto and just clear the map. If your inventory gets full and you haven't yet cleared the whole map, make sure to deposit some of the items inside the chest and continue clearing until you looted pretty much everything. Once you finish looting, don't forget to go back to the chest where you deposited everything and sort out whatever you want to take and what you want to leave. After that go back home and then you can keep doing this until you reach the level that you want. Once you can start crafting better armor and better weapons, I would suggest going ahead and farming the yellow area. You can get a lot more resources, you can get more weapons by opening the chests and you can get also a lot more experience, both from killing the zombies and from actually looting the map. If you guys enjoyed the video, make sure to leave a like and subscribe for more daily Jurassic Survival content. As always, I hope you guys enjoyed the video and I will see you in the next one. Bye bye.